to be in the um, that town. Yeah. It's a land friend of mine. I was talking. About what? <laughs> About where we are. <laughs> what, where, where are we? Trifu. <laughs> Is that how you pronounce it? Wells. Connie. Wells, Trifu, Connie. So we arrived what, out about an hour and 15 minutes later than planned. So we were about 10 miles, 10 miles out from our destination. Um, we got caught in a traffic jam. There was an accident just ahead. Um, air ambulance. Yeah, so it must have been a pretty serious accident for air, air ambulance uh, to come. So we got here an hour and 50 minutes later than planned. But we're here now, we're just taking a walk around, just scoping out the place. <laughs> Finding somewhere to eat. Oh, that's a nice one there, look at that. Yeah, it's for sale <laughs> what? What would you give that out of ten? Uh, about a seven. Seven. Yeah. Okay, I'll give it. Uh, I'll give it an eight out of ten. I would have given it more, but they made us wait about five minutes yeah. before it, the man come with the machine, so we could pay for our meal. We just had a nice little uh, Indian at the restaurant called Ben. Little Indian chef or chief? Chef. Chief. <laughs> In um, where is this? What's this called? Place called? Clandan. Conway. Conway. No, Clandan. La, 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 some. I don't know. <laughs> it's not even on there, is it? Two. Oh yeah, so we're about to um, fuel up on some breakfast before we go on our uh, hike into the mountains. Oh yeah, we need to stock up on some food as well. Coffee and chocolate time. Overloaded with the cream and the hot chocolate. But she said it as well. Got a nice vanilla latte there. Alright, about to get tucked in now. This nice veggie breakfast. Look at that. No trend around here. Look, vegetarian. Bon appetite. I, I, don't under, I didn't understand a one word you said. Let's go and do some hiking.
so I think this is the uh, mountain that we're climbing. <laughs> no, I don't even know. We've got to jump on a on a bus. So we're parked near to the path that we're actually going to come down, which is the miners' truck. But we're going up the Lam Beris path, so we have to go and get what they call is a Sherpa bus. That means, but have to get a bus to the land bearers path. Look at this, we've literally just started. We're going up there, I think it's called the land bearers path. Yeah, I've heard it. And look how steep it is already. Find an alternative path here. Wow. Yeah, this is amazing. I salute you. Yeah, I will. <laughs> Oh yeah, I, sincerely I, I doff my cap to you because I, I wouldn't do it in that. This is going to be a real square if you want, square on it. Yeah, thanks. Amazing. Yeah, should see me coming up. Oh gosh, yeah. <laughs> Is that the way through? Oh, yeah. Yeah, and then up. Oh, okay. Is that is that a different path then? Where they? It's a different path, yeah. Oh. Oh, the ma oh, is that the mine truck path they yeah. call it? It's the truck train. Yeah. Oh, okay. Thank you. Oh, wow.
up with a shoot there. Okay, they got up here. Who knows? I don't know if it's because of the altitude, why I'm so tired and out of breath, or if it's just the sheer difficulty of the walk, considering it's supposed to be the easiest one for beginner hikers. Oh wow, look at this. Oh my gosh, look. Clever clogs here. Yeah. Took a wrong turn in. Well, the wrong path completely. This train track is in. I thought it was the um, miners track path, but it's not. So we're having to come back up to find the right path in order to go back down again because. Uh, the car is parked at the end of the miners track park path so basically we parked in Penn Y Pass area which is where the miners track path starts and end and then we got a taxi to, to the start of the Lamberis the idea was to take the miners track path back down so that we'll be where the car was parked is parked. Going back up to come back down the right path, I can actually see the summit again. Right, back on track now. So this is the minus track path.
this is like a this path is like a game of Tetris. Is Tetris the right description? So basically I'm looking for the easiest path down with the um the least um amount of drop between each stone. I know someone who isn't enjoying it at the moment though. After straying off what we thought was a minus track path and then going back up the mountain again to then rejoin the correct path, a part of the way down, we came to a section where you could go one of two ways. And we asked this couple who seemed to know what they were talking about. They said that um, the way that they were going, which was directly down the mountain towards the lake, they said they were going for a swim. They said that's the way you could you go if you want to go for a swim. But she, they said, um, you just keep going straight that's a quicker route to penny pass where we're going now so i thought okay so plodded along got to a point where we thought hold on a minute let me just check the uh the app the g the official gps app had a look and realized we weren't even on the friggin path we're straight on to another path i think this is a path for more experienced um, hikers so um, admittedly at one point it got a bit scary because we got to a, a point whereby we thought oh where do we go now because there wasn't any clear paths but um, uh, yeah we managed to kind of like find our way on track so though we're not on the official miners track path we are on an on another man-made path which looks like it's one for more experienced hikers we are experienced after so many hours. Yeah. Experience now, back and forth. <laughs> yeah, I think this one is like a baptism of fire. I mean, look. Right. So I don't know if you can see it down there in the distance, where you've got the lake on the left, and to the right of the lake, there's this white winding path. That's the official miners track path and we're all the way up here anyway, you might see a bit better now that's the official path down there Done it. Mine is in pig track. So look, yeah, mine is in true base up. So. Looks like we ended up doing a bit of both. Oh, that was hard work. And so we are back where we started this morning. Parked car in this campsite. Just took a taxi down from the entrance or the start of the um, pig track path. Oh, my feet are aching. My body feels bruised. So no, your head what's going to happen? Now well, we're here. Yeah. So you go to this junction here, turn left here behind the church, and then it takes you down to the main road through the village up to the stone bridge in the middle. Have you seen that? Yeah. yeah. Cross yeah. the bridge, bridge, and then you take a left hand turn. It's quiet road all the way up. It gets very steep there, and it gets very steep there, but it doesn't matter. Right. You ready? Yeah. Right, we just hired a couple of e-bikes for the day. We're gonna go on a little, a little adventure.
last thing I bloody needed. So much for these friggin' e-bikes, the battery just cut out. It's now saying, a, it's now got an error message. So let me try again. No, it's not happening. Battery, battery keeps cutting out and it keeps showing an error message. Oh, it's like an 01690. Seven. How many times has it done yet? Hello, Hi, it's uh, Leon and Tanya here. We just got the uh, the couple of e-bikes, oh, yeah, and yeah. Uh, yeah, about a mile into the ride, my one um, uh, the, keeps cutting out, and it's got an er it was sending an error message. Oh, is it? Yeah. You have you have to bring it back then. Uh, yours is the big one. Yeah. Is it? Was it does it say error anything else? So I think it's seventy one. Hold on a second. Let me see. Oh, that's a battery connection. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, I won't be able to do anything about that. I mean, you can bring it back here. Yeah. Uh, that's all I can do. I can just refund your money, I think. Uh, okay. I mean, I can't fix that. I mean, you can turn in error 71. You should be able to just turn it back on. But um, I can't do anything about that. Uh, really. Okay, let me, I'll try and see if I can persevere. Because when, it, when it switches off and then back on again, it rides for a bit and then the message comes back. Then it comes back again. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's a, that's a battery connection problem, that means. But, uh, I mean, maybe you could bring it back here and I can have a quick look, but I don't suppose it would be a quick fix. Because really, okay. that one's got all the batteries built into the frame, so it's hard to access. Where okay. the, other one, the, the other one's much easier. Okay. Um, yeah, well, so I'll, I'll leave it up to you. I mean, if it doesn't... If it, doesn't get any worse, or if it's not, you know, it's not too frequent, you carry on riding it, just keep turning it back on again. The error 71 is, is the battery connection, that's what it means. Okay. Yeah, well, so I'll, I'll see how it goes. I'll to decide what you want to do. Okay. All right then. Yeah. All right. Thanks. Sorry about that. All right. Other than that, it's exactly the same. Uh, attempt number two. So yesterday, as you know, we took the e-bikes out, Heisman e-bikes, and uh, power unit malfunctioned after about a mile to take them back. So we're back again today. Try again, going the wrong way, Tanya. Clearly a wise decision to wear this top today. Any worse than this.
Garmin telling them to make a U-turn. Don't know why. So I'm having to resort to the old-fashioned way. And these are the good old back. and look at the um, Swallow Falls. Is it called Swallow Falls? Yeah. And um, we are in Sevilla, Spain! <laughs> From uh, walking up Mount Snowden. Oh, the legs, the, the thighs, the quads, is it? I think you call them the quads. Yeah. And the calf muscles. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,
Just walked to the side. Hiya, you alright? Just walked around the perimeter of the town centre and it looks like Conway Town. I may be wrong but from my observation it looks like the town centre is built within side the, um, the castle walls. Free. We're on our way home, but we just stopped off at um, a place called Clan. Where is, was it called Clan the Clan Lochlin, I think. Okay. 